right, we have done it. Incredible! That is exactly right. Oh, it's like a minute and a half later. I will do nothing. Do exactly what I do, which was nothing. In other words, do nothing. Yeah, I got it. It was kind of stupid. That's the way of mimicry. Now you are ready. Uh, th that's not how you spell adieu. Seriously, you misspelled the god part of adieu. And he was thrown into the end zone by himself. And we get 50 ability points for that. And uh, Krill does gain a job level. Ferris gains a job level. I believe that is max for Ferris. And then things glitched out again. I don't understand. But the spirit of these brave warriors rests in these shards. We got another job. We got the mime, of course. But we have to hurry. We gotta motor on out of here. I don't care about the ability points that I might waste by not changing everybody's party because I do believe that even in here the timer stays. Yeah, the timer stays. So we're not we're not fiddling around in the menu. Uh, we're just going to head on out. Yeah, we can deal with the wasted ability points later. For now, I just need to get out. I should have plenty of time, but you know that we could get in battles along the way that could screw that up. Let's go! We can make it! I still have a little bit of time, especially with my thief ready to run. We might be cutting it a little bit closer than I had wanted, but we should still be able to make it. Climb! Climb for all you're worth! It's underwater, it shouldn't be that difficult to climb. <laughs> Let's head up here, and I didn't mean to step there. Still have plenty of time, though. Uh, for the record, pretty much anything that you do against Go-Go will kill you. So try not to do that. I'm going to go back to uh, the Sealed Castle, heal up, change job classes around, and I'll meet you when I'm done. All healed and saved yet again. And I have changed my party around again. Grill is back on Summoner. Ferris is back on Chemist. Grill is getting very close <laughs> to having very little to work on. But we shall move on nonetheless. We shall, however, look at what everybody looks like as a mime. Mime is a unique ability, I must say. Uh, that's what Bart's looks like. That's what Reyna looks like. And that is what Krill looks like. And finally, Ferris, you get a cape. It's awesome. Like a double-colored cape? Is it double-colored for everybody else? No? Just for Ferris. Ferris gets two different colors on the cape. One, I don't know, maybe that's just me. The left side looks green, the right side looks yellow. Now, Mimic is kind of unique. Inside of battle, it Mimics can't use items. However, they do get three abilities that you can uh, set. As you can see here, we get two, we get the job command, and we get the regular ability. Should we be a mime, those all go away, just one giant box, and you get to pick three. And Bart will probably be very, very good as a Mimic, but we're going to continue to go with Knight for now. Uh, there's only one job level for a Mimic, if I remember correctly, and it goes to uh, 999, which is quite a bit and not something I'm willing to do right now. Our first destination for this next little expedition that we are going to is the Pirate Cavern. So let us go into, is it Cavern or Cave? I think it's Pirate Cave. Either way, that is where we are headed. For we want to be a pirate. And Ferris used Let's just head straight for the back. I don't need to heal. I am fine taking on these enemies that have not leveled up this entire game. As you can imagine, it's kind of tedious now. More than it is fun to get through these battles. But they go by rather quickly, so it's not nearly too bad at all. Let's really definitely feels like the game has upped the encounter rate around here, and I'm not sure why. See here, this this is fine. Last time I took like four steps, and we should be able to make it to the end without a, any problems, and we do. What? Did I hear the? Did I hear Hydra? 
Hydra, you're alive! Hydra made it! Uh, wait. Apparently not. Ferris, what is it? Ferris, what do you see? Uh, I thought I saw... I did see me old friend Hydra. Oh, don't tell me Krill can see it. Yeah. Krill can see it, of course. Krill! I don't know what is up with Krill in this game. So they call you Hydra. There, there, that's a good boy. Krill, can you see him? Hydra's spirit says it wants to help you, Ferris. Eh? He's a very gentle spirit. And we've received the summon monster Hydra! We don't get a fanfare for it, though. Because it is sad that Hydra died. Do I have to use it uh, as an item first? I don't think I do. But Hydra fits in quite nicely there. Looks like we just got one or two more to go. Probably two. So, 32 MP. Less than most things. Uh, <laughs> most of the higher ones. More than, more than Titan, but then less than, uh, you know, everything else. <laughs> Hydra, though. You can get Hydra that way. I'll meet you back outside. Actually, I'll meet you where we will start the next destination, which is uh, Mirage Village. That's how we can have to get the next one started. Alright, in order to get to our next destination, we will require the services of a black chocobo, which can only be obtained here in Mirage Village. So, do you have anything new to say? You pass a waterfall on the way? I did pass a waterfall and I got the lamp. Thank you for asking. Uh, we need to... Damn it. <laughs> get out of my way. People, they're always in my way. We need to head through here around this and out through here here is where the black chocobo resides I'm always early always early but using the black chocobo we need to go somewhere that even our airship cannot go and that, for the most part, is south. What we are heading for is the tower th that you have seen in the desert. Uh, let me go show that off before we actually land. The tower that you might have seen on the world map, I definitely saw it, and I think I pointed it out once, is hanging out right here. Unfortunately, there is no place to land using the airship. None. There is a place to land using the Black Chocobo, though! So, he's going to hang out there while we make our journey down to the tower. Oh, I bet we have new enemies here. I bet we do. We have Centipeelers and Land Squids. I do not think we have fought these guys before. If we have, we are watching them again. I don't think Ferris... Well, yeah, Ferris as a chemist is only good for healing. That is it. Go Earth Magic. Desert Storm! That is not enough for the victory, and that somewhat scares me. That is a little unnerving. But we should still be okay. Will you get an attack off, please, Bart? Thank you, S-Shot, for the victory. Well, I should finish off at least one of them. And down goes that one. Now we should be able to take on that one down there. Couldn't steal from him, now. Couldn't steal. Yeah, you're useless. <laughs> Ferris, when, when I have you learning and on chemist, you, there is not much you can do. Quicksand! Insta-death on the centipeeler! Very nice. And then we should just be able to get away with a regular attack on the land squid. Yeah, that does a massive amount of damage. <laughs> Go Brave Blade! 2,289 gil, 1,190 experience, and 4 ability points. 
I'm kind of hoping for more ability points, to be honest with you. Everybody could always use ability points. And, you know, if, if I'm not doing anything else, I could always work on Berserker and Mime. Because those things are huge. They're a thousand each, which is absolutely ridiculous. But I'll do it eventually. More new enemies? Nope. So let's continue our journey. I would love to say that once we got to the tower here, it would be a lot easier, but I know this tower. Same enemies, really? So let's make our way for it, and hopefully I can get through it at least a little bit quickly. Do I have to go in through the side? It wouldn't let me in through the top, which was weird. All right. Phoenix Tower floor number one. The way that this works, it's a little strange. Um, you have, well, I believe there are 30 floors to this. I bet we have new enemies as well. We do. A Disabler and a Serpentina. Totally not a Lamia at all. Uh, the, the stairs will have to appear to you. What you have to do is you have to press X on the wall and hopefully it will show up for you somewhere along the line. That's how you get up the tower. Uh, I believe, once again, 30 floors? I don't have my notes in front of me on, on how many floors, but it is a lot. And Serpentina is using roulette. And down goes Krill. Okay, I bought some Phoenix Downs. I'll need to buy some more. Thanks, Serpentina. You're a lifesaver. Freaking roulette. And I think that is a blue magic that I want Ferris to learn. <laughs> Eventually. Maybe not use it very often. Seriously? That wasn't enough for the victory? I swore that was going to be enough, so I didn't use a shot. Hey, we got a prism dress out of here. Very nice. I will take that. Sonic Boom? That was a weak-ass Sonic Boom. Some of these elements, they have such a random rate to them. It just does not seem worthwhile to me. Alright, this should be enough. Yeah, down you go. You used Rewind on the wrong person. <laughs> you get 1,161 gills, 750 experience, 3 ability points. Let's see, where are my notes? Um... Yeah, I'm pretty sure 30 floors. Yeah, 30 floors. That's what it says in my notes. And it will take me forever. Is it here? It is here. Very nice. I, I don't have these memorized at all. So I, I will be pressing every single one, hoping that it's the way up. 